Now you can get. Let's talk about your story. Mm -hmm. You uh, are happily married to a Ukrainian man now, and uh, you have three children. Four. Four. Yes. Right. And uh, so, but before that, you married a foreigner, uh, a Lebanese man, and it was a bit of a horror story. And you offered to open up and tell us your story, so a Ukrainian woman can learn some some lessons from your painful mistake. Yes. So thank you very much. Uh, tell us your story. From first, I'm uh, married to so so quickly. For after two months, we married, and we get kids, uh, two kids, twins. Uh -huh. And uh, you were how old? You were how old? Then? Twenty-one. Old. Twenty-one. Yes, right. and uh, he speak uh, very soft, and uh, he put for me in my head that he's good man. Mm -hmm. But uh, when we uh, go there after three years, we stay here in Ukraine, and uh, I ask him many times if he can go out to your country, to him country, uh -huh. to Lebanon. Uh, yes, to Lebanon. Uh -huh. When uh, he go there. He said, okay, you will go quickly, and uh, maybe next week we leave Ukraine. Uh -huh. uh, when we go there, he leave me with uh, $100 after one, one month he stay with me. He leave me $100, and he said, I need to go search work outside of country. And he leave me in Ukraine, in uh, Lebanon, for two years with his mother and his family. With $100? Yes. And you didn't have a job? You didn't? Uh, not, of course. Because you don't speak I Arabic don't at speak the time? I speak Arabic. I uh -huh. try to search for work, but uh, I don't speak Arabic and all documents with work in Arabic. Mm -hmm. English, French, not enough. Uh, no, no. No, no, my goodness. When, uh, when I tried to go to embassy and yeah. make, ah, they took my, doc my passport. They said uh, I will lose my passport, uh -huh. and this my passport he stay in. Uh, so he take his your passport. Hand. Yes. So you're like a prisoner now. Yes. You cannot leave I cannot Lebanon. to go out of home even, not uh, only out of country. You can't leave the house. Yes. Why? They they no because maybe I will I don't know maybe they think all Ukra Russian Ukrainian woman is prostitute. Maybe they think like this. Oh, but he told you. He told you, don't leave the house. Yes, oh. they told me, don't leave. And after my number, my old shit, she tell me because we think a Russian woman is not good from this day to don't leave you uh, to go out of house. <laughs> okay, I will stay, but uh, no, this is not good for this woman. So after when I uh, stay like this two years without him, I, I. Uh, I think I need to go outside uh, and I stay better with my family, not with his family. They, they don't love my kids and even this is... Mm. You're in Lebanon, right? Yes. And Sorry, you got me a little confused. I'm, yes, in I'm in Lebanon uh -huh. and I, I decide to go uh, to embassy uh -huh. to make some do some documents for go out of Lebanon. Uh -huh. To go back to Ukraine? To go back, uh -huh. yes. Okay. When I go to, to embassy, ambassador, he told me I cannot make document for you, uh, travel document, uh, and they don't take your kids in frontier. Mm -hmm. uh, you will go there, they can, the police, they will come, they say you don't have document for your kids, and uh, they will put you to prison directly. Wow, so you so literally I'm afraid, are, uh, because I don't want to leave here. my kids here. They can uh, let me go, my, but my kids, they cannot go. Or I will go to prison because I want to try to take children outside. <clears throat> so I decided to live uh, in Lebanon and my husband quickly he come, uh, maybe after one month he back to Lebanon. But two years he was away yes, and he maybe was with outside. $100. And he said I will bring money to, to live and like this and he back empty. Uh, he said uh, I seek there, I cannot search work, I cannot find, I don't work and like this. But I know what he do because he lied to me. He lied many times. He, even for his parents, he lied me to me. He said uh, uh, by telephone when I when we was uh, back a little bit in Ukraine, uh, the big liar to me. Uh, he said my mother died because my mother Italian and she's died. He he told me before mm -hmm. his mother Italian woman. Mm -hmm. He died. He said by, by by telephone to me when he was in Ukraine. When I come to Lebanon and I see eyes and his real mother, I see each mother died. 
Wow, why you understand? This is wow. lie. This is you. I cannot put in my man until now. How he can say his mother died? He lied very much, very much. All what he say for me in Ukraine was very big lie. And he had a gambling problem, you said. Yes. He gambled. Wow. Yes. But it's okay, you liar, but you are my husband and I'm quite woman and I said, uh, okay, I will stay with you, I will try to find uh, work and I will work hardly to my kids uh, stay good in this country. Mm -hmm. And uh, when I understand uh, it's a real not good man and I'm tired from this life, but, uh, I work for a good salary, $1,500 $1, in Lebanon, it's very good money. Mm -hmm. uh, I work good in center beauty center. So you did what you had to do yes. because he does not I make up artist and mm -hmm. I work in the center mm -hmm. and he he let me work because he don't like to work. Mm -hmm. But when I bring salary every month he took it. And he give me 1 dollar every every day for road to the uh, work. If I don't give uh, uh, get money today, I go buy book. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> he think maybe, but it's, thanks God, people uh, good wow. and other people good. So how did the story end? How did you... So the story, the end, did, uh, after seven years without uh, go outside of this country, Lebanon. Lebanon. Seven yes. years you're in yes, Lebanon. Yes, seven years I stay in Lebanon, I didn't go outside. Uh, my mother, she came to me many times, but I don't go. When I see, when I open, after he gave me my passport, after maybe six years, when he, I said, where is my passport? Give it to me. Until now, you don't believe me? If I good woman or not good woman, you see me, I'm not prostitute. I stay with you. You are bad man, but I stay with you. And like this, give me my passport. I start to shout and like this, he give me a passport and I see, because I remember I need to renew it. Uh -huh. Really and works, I yeah. see, yes, I see uh, uh, my passport uh, is uh, well uh, finished mm -hmm. after some uh, some months. Mm -hmm. And we go to embassy, embassy and uh, they tell me, uh, you need to go uh, to Ukraine to remove it. And I say, thanks God, I will go to Ukraine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and he let me go alone with kids. And uh, for in the uh, front, in the... Uh, when I go to aircraft, I ask any uh, any woman with kids. I ask what document you need to go outside. What you need to how you make documents. What you prepare. Documents what to you, get your children to get out my of Ukraine? children outside. I don't want to leave my kids for this man mm -hmm. because he killed them. Uh, not kill uh, like kill. Yes, mm -hmm. he killed him sociality. Mm -hmm. He killed them uh, health. Mm -hmm. Then don't don't make sport. They don't have not plans. A good no, he's not good father. What he can give for kids after when they will grow? They will stay, work in some supermarket, clean supermarket. What they want to do? So how you get them out? How did you get them out? I uh, come here in Ukraine. I uh, make second passport. No, passport. And if when I have, uh, they give me second my old passport in my hand. Mm -hmm. uh, I think if he will took my passport, uh, I will, uh, I can go out with another one. I have two passports uh, uh, open. Mm -hmm. One he will finish after two months mm -hmm. and one uh, new one. And I think if he will take, I will go with another one. I, I bring only one passport to him. O okay, sorry, this is my liar to him that I gave him two passports, but I decide to leave this country and give for my mm -hmm. children better future. When I go, <laughs> my girlfriend, she helped me only, a Lebanese woman, and she, she said to me, if I don't know what you feel, and, and I don't see your blue slab on your body, he slapped me sometime, and he kids you, also, he yes, he gives me sometime, yes. Yeah. Uh, if, she tell me, if, you, if I don't see your cry every mm. time, uh -huh. uh, I don't let you go out of country. But I see it and I see all these things, what you feel. Uh, and she's bringing up all these yes. old memories, yeah. Thank you for sharing. That. And she, no, it's okay, now it's Lee and uh, it's go and thanks God and mm -hmm. everything is okay now. Mm -hmm. 
when I um, leave this country, she helped me to leave. Mm -hmm. She buy ticket for me. And, uh, I come without money to Ukraine because all I spend to ticket, that I take salary, mm -hmm. but it's okay. I'm happy that I come back to Ukraine and mm -hmm. I'm healthy and my kids healthy. And yeah. When we come back here, maybe about, uh, about six months, I meet my uh, Ukrainian man and he was very good and he was a true man. Every time he tell me only true and he helped me to forget my story. Mm -hmm. And it's really love now, mm -hmm. and uh, everything is okay. It has a happy ending, <laughs> yes. which is really good. Yes. Yeah. Sorry for my crying. No, no, it's great. And Vadim is a, a really great man. I'm yes, very happy he's a very good you man. He's uh, a he's good one. owner his business. He mm -hmm. uh, every time helped me to don't forget that I woman. Mm -hmm. uh, he, we have uh, two kids more now, mm -hmm. for, and my kids for him. Uh, like his kids, mm -hmm. uh, from first he took it like this. Mm -hmm. well, this is our kids. We have four kids. He don't even our friend, some friend. They don't know that two first kids. This is uh, only my. Mm -hmm. They know this is our each other. Mm -hmm. and blended family. And he takes your kids in as his own, which is yes, which is great. Yes. So I uh, really want to say to our women mm -hmm. and men also because in ukraine also have no good women they need to care there's and some not good women yes some yes some, not yes, all of yes, course of course, of course. Uh -huh. but there is and they need to care they need to know each other not only one week two week they need to talk maybe more long time mm -hmm. it will, to, to know this person to understand you need this person or you or you want to stay only one month and after you will cry that uh, she go or he go. Yeah. Or they have he this expression in Ukraine, right? You must eat, what, 17 kilos of salt? Uh, yes, of uh, course. With your man to get to yes. know before you get married. Yes, yes. Uh, and also with this Ukrainian man, we married not uh, directly. We married after four years. Mm -hmm. And I don't know if I was need this marriage. I love this man and uh, of course I want to stay with him, but I, mean, I don't need the stamp in passport. Mm -hmm. This is not uh, like... Uh, you don't need to leave the Ukraine, need, you mean? I don't want to leave Ukraine, you don't of, want course. To, of course. But yeah. we put stamp in passport for me, for us, ah, and uh, outside they don't put uh, stamp in passport when uh, you marry. No, we don't. In yes. Ukraine in you Ukraine stamp, we stamp passport yes. when you're married yes. and with children. Uh, the children are stamped in the yes, passport as well. Yes. So it's easy to tell if the Ukrainian woman is already married because her passport says so. Yes. Uh -huh, but yes. not us Western men, it doesn't have Yes, this. yes. yes, yes. So, uh, well, thank you uh, for sharing your story, Evgenia. I mean, that, uh, and you know, ladies here, Ukrainian women hear your story, uh, it's good advice that you mm -hmm. have, right? Based on your story. To really know your man, take the time. Maybe take a trip to his country of before course, you get married. Of course, because uh, get to know him. person she's open only is his place. It has to be built up this trust. Yes. You know, marriage has to be a foundation of, of trust. Of course, of course. And how you build trust over time? Over time you need to uh, trust. At least Not some time, enough yeah. time. Yes. And different people are different ways, but thank you so much for sharing your story. You're welcome. You're welcome, Julie. And thank you for, for uh, uh, you know, I want to uh, write book for uh, my story. For remember everything what I uh, start to forget many things, but I remember so many things. It's and I think it's enough to women understand. Be careful before you meet some men and you marry quickly. I think you should write a book. I mean. I, I need it's just good. my you kids have, little bit advice. grow because advice. yes yes because my small daughter she's 11 months old uh, so when she will grow so I, I will write mm -hmm. and I will have more big time <laughs> well let me know when you write the book I'd be happy to uh, help market it for you okay thanks <laughs>